What do I do when COVID's outside and I'm scared to go out? Well, that's easy. I just do a, a product taste test and review and tell you what I think about it. Well, I'm not gonna be needing this this round because this isn't gonna be hot at all. So I don't need my water. I will, however, uh, ask for your forgiveness in advance because I cannot speak Spanish. And my daughter brought me a, a some Spanish candy. I don't know if I'm gonna be pronouncing these right, okay? So just kind of bear with me on that. Um, this is made by Bimbo Nito or Bimbo Nito. I, I really don't know. Hey, that all rhymed. Bimbo Nito, I really don't know. Anyways, it says chocolate cream filled sweet baked goods. Four individual packages. So I'm gonna open this baby up. Slide this on out. And this is what they look like, guys. Uh, this is surprising. They come in four little plastic packages. I'm gonna set this over here. And uh, I'm gonna eat one. I don't wanna eat too many because you know, eating too many sweets, it's not good for anybody. And I'm gonna tell you what I think of them. So I, I have to be careful because my daughter could be watching and also, I'm not sponsored by anybody, so I'm going to give you an honest review. Here's what it looks like. It has chocolate frosting on the top. The bottom looks just like regular like donut dough. So here it goes, guys. Hmm. Sweet yet satisfying. The the topping tastes kind of like a mixture between chocolate, and maybe a hint of cinnamon. I'm not really for sure. The bread is very kind of like mushy, almost like it's hard but it's soft. Something like angel food cake, but it's not angel food cake. Let me get another bite. Mm. So as I've noticed, this actually has three, this actually has three layers to it. It has the, the dough around it, and then it has a filling. It is filled with brown sugary goodness, which I think that's where the, the hint of cinnamon's coming from, or it could be chocolate. I'm not for sure or the cinnamon could be coming from the top here, but this thing is different and in a good way, it tastes pretty good. Mm. See, that's kind of like a, dare I say the bimbo guy on there. It looks a little bit like somebody we know, maybe the Pillsbury Doughboy but it has a he has a little bee a bee on his hat and i think that could that stands for bimbo i would read you guys the ingredients but it looks like a science experiment and it would take about a day and a half Mm. So overall, 
here's what I think of this product. This product, it didn't break down on my hands. So that's a plus. I don't like when candy like smushes all over my hands. I did when I was younger, but not now. It's also sweet, but not too sweet. So if you, it's right in the middle for me. So if you're a person that has a sweet tooth and it has to be sweet as a birthday cake, then it might not be for you. But if you want a moderately good sweet snack that probably won't give you diabetes, then this, this snack is for you. And if you don't mind it having Spanish lettering, which I don't mind at all, then this is also for you. But they're not available everywhere. In fact, in the video description, I will tell you and show you where you can get your very own. So guys, I hope that you have enjoyed the, another taste test and product review. And until the next time guys, smash the like button if you like my video. Uh, hit the subscribe button. I could always use more subscribers. Tell people about my channel. And uh, until next time, have a good day.